Yeah, it's a semi-automatic uh, assembly process with a human-robot interaction environment on the shop floor and manufacturing lab environment. And uh, human-robot interaction systems have to manage and coordinate between humans and robots, as you know. And according to the requirements uh, for collaborative industrial robots, um, you have to comply with the huge range of uh, regulations and standards mm -hmm. and uh, this is why the use case comprises the execution of assembly tasks by human workers and focuses on the assembly of transformer units in this case and uh, which consists of multiple parts. Yeah, the needs uh, for a safe and secure assembly of these uh, transformer units and the recognition of the, and localization of, of the parts and the human itself, uh, you have, that is of vital importance actually. And uh, the localization is realized through data tracking uh, and data from various involved components, which are for example an IPC, IoT components uh, and ultra wideband based indoor localization system and last but not least a wearable fiber optical sensing system for human motion uh, recognition. And uh, this is an inherently safe functioning of the components which needs to be in ensured and uh, only through this a smooth um, flow of interaction is, is secured. Accordingly there is a need for the simplified testing and of these often complex systems and uh, virtual validation approach that is needed. Uh, within values, uh, the virtual validation approach, uh, which use fault injection into data streams, is been applied here and uh, used to evaluate safety and uh, security systems. Um, the actual validation object is the virtual model of the uh, complete assembly process, uh, including the robot, including the conveyor belt and the position of the worker. So for enabling the validation dedicated to virtual models of the production line, um, parts, sensors, communication systems and networks have to be created, integrated into a holistic simulation environment. And the whole architecture then, and the whole setting is uh, been assessed regarding its fault tolerance in a pure virtual environment afterwards.